Hey guys, it's Avery, and today I'm going to be filming the common black girl tags, so let's get started. Question number one is, have you ever been told you sound like a white girl? Yes, but not recently. Question number two is, do you drink Starbucks? Yes, every time I walk into Target, I get something to drink from Starbucks, because there's a Starbucks in my Target. Question number three, do people say I get up? It depends on how I feel at the moment and who I'm around. Question number four, can you dance? Girl, let me tell you, I could freak it down. JK, I actually can't really dance, but here's a picture of me when I used to take ballet. Actually, lyrical. Not even ballet. Question five, do you eat soul food and do you know what it is? Yes, I know what soul food is. Do I eat it? I only eat certain kinds of soul food. Like I'll eat macaroni and I will eat mashed potatoes. I will not eat collard greens, chicken, fried. Question number six is, do you go to a private public or charter school? As of right now, I go to a Catholic school. It's like a Catholic private school. And I have been to every single one of those schools except for a charter school. So yeah. Question number eight is, how many selfies do you take daily? Actually, that's usually none. It, it depends on my mood. Usually, question number nine is, do you always try to look presentable? No, because I'm not trying to look presentable now. Look at this. I got on this like banana, an uh, old hoodie that actually belongs to my friend. Question number ten is, what are your average grades in school? So, uh, probably like between B's and C's. I don't know. I'm not really good at school, really. Question eleven is, do you have a lot of friends? And no. Nope. Question number 12 is how many followers do you have on Instagram? The one that I put the link in the description has like a little bit of followers, but the one that is like my more personal account has 1.6k as of right now, which isn't a lot because I lost a lot of followers due to Instagram, like, you know, doing all that ghost stuff. Question 13, does your name have an Isha job or unique in it? Um, no, my name is Avery Renee. Question number 14 is do you roll your neck or eyes commonly? I don't like rolling my neck, but I will roll my eyes on occasion. I'll admit to it. I, just, I don't want to. I will. Question number 15 is how often do you get an egg tune? So my egg tune can actually be pretty bad, especially like on school days because I have tinnitus and people stress me out. My egg tune at school can be so bad. It's a lot better when I'm home than when I'm alone. Right, question 16 is, do you like Taylor Swift? I don't mind Taylor Swift. Question number 17 is, have you ever had to deal with racism? No, because usually when there are racist situations, they don't necessarily, are di they aren't necessarily like directly toward me, so no. Question 18 says, and I cannot pronounce the word ethnicity, whatever. Uh, question 18 says, would you date a white boy or any other ethnicity outside of your business? I can't say ethnicity. Ethnicity. Oh, well. Um, sure, why not? Actually, a guy like now is like mixed with... It was about like Indian, like French or something. So, sure, why not? 19 is, do you wear weave and if so, how often? Uh, no, I do not wear weave and I don't have a weave in right now. But I actually don't mind weave, so it's just hair. Gen 20, are you light skin, brown skin, or dark skin? Right now, from the window light and because of this camera, I look light skin slash like brown skin. But I guess I would call myself like in between white and brown, like caramelish. Are you described as loud or quiet? It depends on who I'm around. Usually at school, I'm pretty quiet. Question 22, what's the most annoying question you get asked? Can I touch your hair? Um, that's it. Question number 23, have you ever been called ratchet? No. Question number 24, did you cut your head or do you do the assistant scratch? No, if my head is itchy, I will scratch it. Question number 26 says, who is your favorite African American couple? My mom and my dad. Question number 27, what African American women do you love to? I like Rosa Park, Harriet Tubman, and I really, and oh, and my grandparents, well my grandma, and on both sides of my family, my mom and my dad's side, and basically all the women in my family because I feel like they're really tough women and really strong so yeah basically almost all the women in my family. Question number 27 says what is your favorite thing about being African-American? I actually don't really have a favorite thing I feel like it's just life and no matter what race you are you still gotta go through life anyway so Question number 28 is do you like fried chicken or do you, and do you like watermelon? Actually no I hate watermelon and I actually hate fried chicken because I don't like chicken with bones in it. 
to number 29 says is your natural hair long. Come up to about around here. So I guess near like my collarbone area. Question 30 asks, do you commonly talk with your hands? Talk with my hands if I'm doing a video. Usually in person, I won't normally talk with my hands unless I'm trying to like explain something. Question number 31 was already asked, but are you described as a loud person? Mm, it depends on who I'm with and what my surroundings are. Just depends. Question number 32 says, have you ever been in a physical fight? Yes, and I was in a physical fight. Uh, before Christmas break started. And then she tried to apologize. I was like, girl, if you valued our friendship before, you would have never touched me. Number 33 says, you know how to get me work? Question number 33 says, do you know how to work? And answer that's in the house. Number 34 asks, do you have any white friends? Like, I have like a little bit of internet friends and they're white. So yeah, I guess so. And my best friend from grade was white and her name was Georgia. Question number 35, which is also the last question, it is, uh, did you enjoy the stack? Yeah, yes, stack was very nice. <laughs> So, bye guys. Thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys next Monday with an all-new video.